KHYI 95 through the range and the range trucks.com studio. Randy Brown, rodeo this. And if we're going to play rodeo this, that means we got to talk rodeo. We got our good friend Casey Cox in from the Zimmer Kubota PBR Challenge coming up August 4th at the Allen Events Center. And uh, Casey, good to see you again. Morning, morning. Good to see you. And uh, you have brought in a, a special guest for us this morning. Yeah, it's pretty exciting. I think I'll let him uh, maybe introduce himself real quick. Uh, I am going to introduce <laughs> myself. All you got to do is to say, I know that the voice. I know, I know. So yeah, That's not that, the voice we know. <laughs> that's just made New York City. Let's go a different direction. All right. Come on, boys. The way you lollygagging around here with them picks and them shovels, you'd think it was 120 degrees. Can't be more than 114. Oh, man. Burton Gilliam, how you doing, brother? I am so good. And I'm so proud to be here with Casey and, uh, and talking to you, pal. Hey, I got to tell you, before we get into the rodeo stuff, because we got a lot of rodeo stuff, I, I was thinking about you this week because I was checking messages on, on my phone machine out here at the radio station on monday and i got a a message left from a royce carter he said he lost 10 pounds so he wouldn't have to box you back in the back in the day (laughs) royce carter yeah Yeah, we we were you know i was a golden glove fighter and so was he and we had great times and 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 i was i was scared to death I mean, I, I had 214 fights, 217 fights, and I was scared to death. But, boy, the more afraid I was, <laughs> the more trouble that guy was in. <laughs> I found out that that speed and fear go hand in hand. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, those are great days. Yeah, so I, he 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 called and left a message, said oh, okay. hi. I, I've got his number, so I'll give that to you if you'd like Please to connect do. with him. Okay, yeah. yeah. Let's uh, let's talk rodeo and, and and Casey. Why have we got Mister Golden Gloves, Gloves, Mister <laughs> Firefighter, Mister Mister Blazing Saddles, Mister Voice of KHYI in this morning? Well, uh, I was given an opportunity through a uh, uh, lady through the Allen Economic Development Corporation, and and Burton lives in Allen, and. Uh, yeah. They brought him into one of the meetings we had, and I'm a huge fan. It's probably one of the top three favorite movies of all time of mine, Bur- yeah. Blazing Saddles. So oh, oh, I, I definitely knew who he was. Soccer dog. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and they told me that uh, that he he would gladly be involved with helping us, you know, promote this PBR and and for a good cause for the uh, Allies and Service Roger Stahlbach's, uh Veterans Charity, and and so I took him up on the offer, and and it was well, it's, hell yeah, it's, yeah. I mean, it's not every day you get to hang out with somebody that you you know you watched on on uh, Blazing Saddles a million times, and, or, or Back to the Future Part Three. Yeah, there you go. Well, I mean yeah. that, or, or 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 Charlie's Angels, or the A Team, or the Fall Guy, or the Dukes of Hazard. I, I don't know what to say. <laughs> or Fletch. <laughs> or Fletch. Or Fletch. Yeah, that's a good picture. Right? That's a good that's picture. That's a good picture. Yeah. yeah. So, so, so Casey comes to you and he says, hey, uh, I want you to be part of this and, and want you to be involved. The city wants you to be involved. And you just say, yeah. And I said, yes, Tracy Klein with the Allen Economic Development corporation uh asked me if i'd get involved i said sure so i'm i'm kind of like on the am i on the board of directors or anything i know i go in and i sit in this chair you know (laughs) and and they talk you know so i'm real real proud to do this because most people think i'm a cowboy yeah you know better yeah you're a golfer (laughs) (laughs) i have ridden horses all of my life from from the time I was nine years old, but uh, if you see me on a horse now, I'm getting paid. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what about a bull? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> no bull! I, no bull! Me, no bull! <laughs> <laughs> no bull from you. There, that, and that's no bull. <laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs> Well, it, it, it's it's a, it's a big event. It's it's going to be a lot of fun, and, and we were just talking about uh, uh, some of the stuff that's going to be happening at the event, um, and, and it's coming up August fourth. And, and here's one of the things that I love about this event is you were a first responder. You know, yeah. you, you were a firefighter, and, and Casey and the guys have a discount. 
for first responders because they care about first responders and, and they care about what they do for our community. And, and I think that's great that, that those guys get a break on, on their tickets to come oh, see gosh, this. Yeah. And, and, you know, there, there are so many firefighters and policemen and other first responders in this in the North Texas area that that I know and many, many, many more that I don't know yeah. who have done such a wonderful job in, in all of the, uh, the first responders things uh, and they are so good to me. Yeah. They're good to me personally. If I, if I say I need a little bit of help, I mean if I don't even know them, they say hey, you're an ex-firefighter we're coming man. Yeah. So they're they're wonderful people. Absolutely, and and, and that discount, Casey, is is ten percent. Yeah, but you got all, go- all veterans, mil- current military personnel, uh, all first responders. Go to the Val and Vent Center box office. That's, you got to go there to get the yeah. discount. Yeah, you can't get them online and get the discount, but if you go there in person, you take just a few minutes, it, it's going to be worth it because uh, you're going to get to come to a fun event. Yeah. How many bulls you got now? Uh, there'll be 45 in the long round and a, and a 10, 10 bull short round. It's the rankest bulls in the world and, yeah. the, and the best bull riders go head-to-head at this thing. Yeah. It's, it's going to be good. And, and uh, this is the 25th anniversary of the PBR, so it's a Celebrate America tour, and we're going to we're gonna honor some uh, some a fireman a, a, a police officer from the city of allen and we've got some uh, some big time veterans coming that we're going to honor in the opening ceremonies pyrotechnics i mean this is a this is a production yeah. you're going to want to see it it's it's going you don't want to miss this opening i promise you it's it's uh you're going to you're going to hear a national anthem like you've never heard it before i promise you that and nobody's going to be kneeling either no 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 the pbr <laughs> everybody involved yeah. with the pbr signed a pact last year that uh even i mean from brazil to australians to the uh uh, Canadians, everybody, all the Cowboys and the Bullfighters, everything signed a pact that, that nobody in the PBR is going to kneel during the National Anthem. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah I we'll, go we'll, for that. We'll, yeah, it's, it's, it's going to be a lot of fun. Burton's going to be there. Uh, I, I got to ask what else you got going on. Because, man, you, besides golfing, I, I know that uh, you had been, last year you worked on a uh, a movie. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the uh, Lucky Man I, I, or something like lucky that. Lucky Man, yeah, yeah. Um, and that, and Lucky Man is about the third thing, the third name they put on it. Uh, <laughs> yeah, when they start changing names, then, on, then you worry about the, it, right? I, I, oh, I'd say it's dead. <laughs> <laughs> and that's a direct to Netflix type flick, right? <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Uh, have you thought about that? I mean, because you're such a great character actor. Have you Have you thought about going to Netflix and say, "Hey, you know, I'll, I'll be," because they, they're throwing money left and right. Oh God. Gosh, it, for no reason to go left and right. <laughs> yeah. I, I, see, I don't know. I don't know the the trail you go down to do yeah. all that yeah. stuff. I don't know the people, and and I'm happy with my life. I yeah. really am. Uh, I'll do uh, fifty commercials a year, and I'll go do personal appearances. 15, 20 times all over the country, and a lot of it to do with Blazing Saddles. There's, yeah. a, there's a resurgence of Blazing Saddles among group, small groups yeah. of, of 1,500 people here. 1500, yeah. yeah. So, uh, shoot, let's just roll with the tide and uh, and make a few putts. Yeah. Well, yeah. well, see, making putts. There you go. Putting. How about putting with burton you, you make it a series on netflix you, you bring in guests and you interview guests who and, and you do it on the putting green man it sounds good to me and, I th- here's what and, and I then want, i get a little cut of it now here's what i want to call it then okay i thought this up myself all right putting is for sissies <laughs> <laughs> golf is about getting out there on that tee and hitting that thing 400 yards yeah. then you get on the on the green and you make you try to make a little four foot putt right yeah that's putting is for sissies <laughs> <laughs> there you go there's a new show netflix call us call me and, and we'll get burton and we'll yes. get this thing hooked up and and i'll just take a, a small Fifteen percent cut. That's all. <laughs> all right. Coming up on August fourth, uh, we are going to have at the Allen Event Center the Zimmer Kubota PBR Challenge. It's going to be a lot of fun. Tickets start at just twenty five dollars. You can get them at the Allen Event Center, especially if you're a first responder. Let them know and show them the uh, information there. And as uh, well, Ticketmaster dot com as well under the Zimmer Kubota PBR. If you put in PBR in the search deal, it'll be the first one it pulls up. Absolutely, Burton. Pleasure to see you, man. Always a pleasure to see Bad. you. 
I'll, I'll, I'll always love to see it. Casey, who we got coming in next week? You got an idea yet? Uh, yeah, uh, Lucas Teodero. He's the first Brazilian bullfighter to travel to the United States to fight bulls. He's he's your he's going to be your next up and coming superstar. I mean, he yeah. already is the up and coming superstar. But uh, I'm going to bring him in next week. He's a really neat guy to talk to, and uh, like I say, he'll be protecting the Cowboys at the event at Allen, so everybody will get to get to meet him. And, and you can bring Burton back in to be his translator for us. Yeah, yeah, that'll be fun. <laughs> yes, you picked the right guy here. Come on. Bro. All right, uh, with uh, 95.3 The Range, get your tickets for the Zero Kubota. PBR Challenge coming up on August 4th. Let's do some brand new music for you right now from Mike of the Moon Pies.